Hey guys, what's up? My name is Sonali and today I'm going to be sharing with you guys why I chose to go to the University of Central Florida. currently a senior majoring in radio television and minoring in sociology. So before I go into why I chose UCF, I wanted to give you guys a quick background story of how I even got to have UCF in my college choices. So first off, I was born in Jacksonville, Florida, and I moved to Georgia when I was three. So my parents actually bought Florida prepaid college fund. I think that's what it's called. I'm not really sure, but basically it's something that you can put away money as your child grows up and I guess they put in a little money too. So then when you get to college, you kind of get like a discount off your tuition. I mean, it's obviously pretty much your money that you've already paid, but you kind of just like save up in a fund, which is pretty cool, but I definitely didn't think so when it came to picking colleges because I actually wanted to go to literally anywhere in Georgia. I just wanted to stay in my comfort zone. I was just so comfortable here in Georgia with like my friends, my boyfriend was gonna stay in Georgia, and I just didn't wanna move away from home. I never had a desire to go away from home. So when it came to actually picking colleges, I really thought I was gonna stay in Georgia, but this whole time my parents were like, no, you're going to Florida, no, you're going to Florida. But I was so in denial that I just thought I was going somewhere in Georgia. So when it came time to fill out applications, they were so for real that I only could apply to Florida schools because I had Florida prepaid college fund, and I was just like so heartbroken, but I was just like, you know what, whatever, like I'm just gonna apply. And so my two choices were FSU and UCF. My sister was a senior or a junior at the time when I was applying at FSU. So my dad, my mom pretty much wanted me to go to FSU because they just thought it would be a little bit easier, like visiting us, it's only four hours away instead of seven to eight hours away. And yeah, everything would just be easier, I guess. So we decided to tour UCF because I honestly had no idea what UCF was. I never heard of it before like senior year. So I didn't know what it looked like. I didn't even know where it was. So we went to tour it and on the way we were actually stopping by FSU to visit my sister. And I didn't tour the school senior year, but I did tour it with my sister when she was applying to colleges. And of course that was when I was like in middle school or something. So I didn't really have to care about college that time, but we just kind of stopped by on the way down there. And then the next day we went to UCF to tour it. So it's funny because like my first impressions of this little college town, it's funny because I say little now, but I thought it was humongous. I remember stopping by Chipotle before we went on tour and just eating really quick. And I thought Chipotle was literally 20 minutes away from the college, but now that I know where it is, it's so close. And it's just so funny that the first time you go anywhere, you think it's so big but now I just know where everything is so I think it's like small now I don't know it's funny how that works out but anyways we went on our tour and oh my gosh I was like blown away because everything's just so new and updated and like modern and they have their traditions like the spirit splash and just homecoming week and so much more but their campus is just so updated and like technologically advanced and it's not old and that's something that really pulled me in because I love newer things. I love modern things. And I knew going to college, I didn't really care about going to a super traditional school. So I don't know. I just thought it was amazing how beautiful the campus was. There was palm trees everywhere. I freaking love palm trees. It just makes me feel like so tropical, like I'm on vacation at school. So they made the students and the parents split up. So my mom got to have her own little orientation. I remember meeting back up with her and her telling me all the things that like UCF has to offer students. Like she was blown away with like how much things that they thought of for the students. And I was especially happy because that means I got one parent on my side of going to UCF. So it was time to convince my dad. And it didn't really take much to convince him because in the end it was my choice. And Honestly, like at the beginning of this whole thing, I didn't think it was my choice. I thought I was just going to go to FSU. But once I made the choice, I was actually excited to start college and get a change of scenery, which I didn't think I would be excited about because I didn't want to leave my home. At that time, I had no idea what coming to UCF was going to do for me. 
It pushed me out of my comfort zone and I made such good lifelong friends here. And it definitely gave me the independence that I needed because I feel like while I was growing up, I was just so dependent on my friends, my sister, my parents, just anyone that I could latch on to. But when you're put in that situation and you're in a whole different city, you're kind of forced to be more independent and a little bit more outgoing. It's literally so weird to think that I live in Florida because I know I was born there, but I don't really remember my life there because I was only there until I was three. So going to school in a vacation spot is so cool to me. And there's so much to do around the place too. And that was another big thing. Like I didn't really know what I wanted to be going into college, but I definitely knew that Orlando was the spot for opportunities. And now thinking about it, I feel like I would never survive in a college town because I love to go eat, I love to go shop, I like to do entertaining things such as going to iDrive or going to like downtown Disney or Universal City Walk. It's so cool that we have all these fun things to do pretty close to UCF. It's honestly insane how one little decision can change your whole life and your whole future. And I'm so grateful that I did choose UCF. So that is the story of why I chose University of Central Florida. And I'm so excited to be going into my senior year. You can follow me on Instagram at so underscore gnarly without the G to follow along with my UCF lifestyle. If you guys are curious, comment down below if you guys are thinking about going to UCF or are already a knight. I also have a bunch of other UCF and college related videos. So I will link that playlist down in the description box, so definitely check that out while you're here on my channel. I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye guys!